Hi, we're out in the Folsom Park right now, and it is absolutely gorgeous, and it means the summer is right around the corner. And what does that mean? Mosquitoes. Who seems to become lunch for all the mosquitoes within 100 miles? If it's you, do you hold your breath while spraying that toxic repellent over your head, arms, and length? Check it out. This is good information. Hi, I'm Kevin Fritz with Iron Point Mortgage here in Folsom, California, your Sacramento area mortgage broker. And you know, we all know that living in the Sacramento Valley and Sierra foothills means dealing with tons of mosquitoes during the nicest parts of the year when we love being outdoors. Isn't that always a pain? There's been a lot of talk over the years as to the effectiveness of different lotions, sprays, citronella, when it comes to keeping the mosquitoes at bay. So I've invited Lindsay King here today to demonstrate how to make your own using essential oils. Thanks for being here, Lindsay. Thank you, Kevin. It's a pleasure. Are you ready to get started? Absolutely am. Hey, first tell us what base you're using and which essential oils are in the mosquito repellent recipe. Absolutely. Well, what I use is I use an ounce of distilled water, and you can find that at any local um, big box store or pharmacy, and that's right here. And I put one ounce in a spray bottle, and then I'm going to use three essential oils, Terra Shield, Lemongrass, and Eucalyptus. Now, are there any other uses for, for these? What, what's your favorite? I love the smell of Terra Shield, and let me tell you, having pets at home and having children, knowing that they can touch this and not be contaminated or worry about chemicals, it's just a wonderful feeling to have as a mom. Absolutely. All right, excellent. So let's make it. What do we do? Okay, so this is super simple. All you need to do is a spray bottle, the distilled water, and these three oils. So I'm just going to add the drops in. I'm going to use six drops of the Terra Shield. And then I'm going to use two drops of the lemongrass and the eucalyptus. So here we go. And a drum roll, please. Here we go. We're making it. This is how the magic happens. So we're going to count them out. It's like doing shots, huh? Right? All right. One, two, three, four, five, six six drops of our Terra Shield. And now I've added the lemongrass and the eucalyptus oils and we are ready. Fantastic. Now what do we do? All you need to do is you mix it up and it is ready to go. And I don't know if you can do this with any sprays that you have at home, but it's completely safe and pure. And tasty too. <laughs> So if you have dogs or little one-year-olds who like to put their fingers in their mouth after they've been sprayed with bug spray, no worries here. Great. And hey, it's a whole lot better than uh, the other stinky stuff that you buy in the store. And it works too, right? It does work. Actually, um, I always add a little bit of peppermint into mine as well because I don't like the spiders either. Nice. So get rid of the spiders and the mosquitoes. Keep the kids safe. Have a fun time at summertime. Hey, if you're trying to save money, this is a great way to do it. Also, if you're looking at buying your next house and you're trying to save money, give us a call. We'd be happy to help you. Again, I'm Kevin Fritz with Iron Point Mortgage, and we're always here to help. Thanks for being here with us, Lindsay. We really appreciate it. Thank you, Kevin. It's been a pleasure. Oh, hey, if they want to reach you, how do they get a hold of you? Oh, there's actually a link for my website, and you can just contact me with any questions you might have. Great. Have a great week.